Hello, students. I'm Goran, and today we're going to see some vocabulary which is related to household appliances. I'm sure all of you have a lot of household appliances in your home that you use every day. Today you can find many modern appliances that make everyday life easier. As well as being practical, these appliances can be energy efficient, which means they consume less electricity. Some of these appliances are used by your mothers in the kitchen. On this picture, we can see some of them. Microwave, cupboard, blender, oven, teapot, fridge, Cooker. Which one is your favorite? My favorite one is fridge. Then we can see a frying pan, a pot, a plate, a teapot, cutlery. Wooden spoon, spoon, spatula, ladle, fork, knife, chopping board, grater, measuring cap, rolling pin. All these are appliances that are mostly used in the kitchen. Not only by your mothers, but also in the restaurant kitchens, where a delicious food is prepared. The place where we spend quite a lot of time when we want to relax and where the whole family gathers is the living room. In this room, there are also many appliances that are an integral part of our everyday life. Television, fireplace, curtains, lamp, armchair, Sofa, carpet, chandelier, plant, chair, cushion, but the bathroom is the room when in we in which each of us Take care of our appearance. Towel. Shower. Step. Wash basin. Bathtub. Shower enclosures. Toilet. I hope all these are familiar to you. Now let's see some, let's do some exercises related to the vocabulary that we are paying attention on today. When I want to drink a fresh juice made from fresh fruits, I use the 
your answer would be Blender. Oh, I feel so cold today. I need to make a tea into my new teapot. Mom, I'm so thirsty. Is there cold water in the fridge? Can I boil an egg into the microwave? No, you can't. What time is it? It's 5 a.m. Oh no, I'm going to miss my favorite TV show. Our television doesn't work. I forgot to turn off the tap. It will flood my bathroom. I hope these words were familiar to you and some of you some of you maybe learned some new words. When you go shopping for different electrical appliances, or household appliances, you usually go to a department store where there are a lot of sections and you go to the section for the electrical appliances or household appliances and you must talk to the shop assistant in order to help you to make a better choice what to buy. The things you should consider are the price, the quality of the product, the warranty and the energy efficiency. That was all for today. Thank you for your attention.